Hello, fellow Araxians. Commander Sirius here. Well, this is the most expected story ever. There's some Reddit drama. Normally, that's just the story every day. But since the subreddit's been closed for about a month, the fact that there is some Reddit drama is actually news. And today we're going to talk about it. Let's dive in. So guys, about a month ago, the subreddit went dark. The mods decided to close it down in solidarity with the protests against Reddit monetizing third-party use of the API. Now, an in internet timeline, that's like 10 years ago and ancient past that most people have forgotten about. Now, it wasn't just the Planet Side 2 subreddit that took part in this. It was a lot of subreddits. And the Reddit admins went scorched earth on the really big ones. Nuked the mod teams, in some case replaced them with Reddit personnel, in some cases found new mods. The deal was reopen the subs normally or else. And after the major subreddits, the ones with 10 million plus, they worked their way on down the line. Now Planetside 2 is hovering right around 86,000 subs. That's not huge, but it's not nothing. I think because we were under the 100,000 subscriber threshold, we pretty much flew under the radar. It's a very unique period for Planetside in that we're past the 10 year mark. So it's kind of like the game sort of run its course in that sense. The lead designer Rel had just left and the subreddit has been extremely inactive for the past six months. So while sure the mods were probably protesting Reddit's changes, I think there was probably also a little bit of just sick of being a mod, not really wanting to pass the baton but at the same time, not wanting to have to deal with it every day. So closing the subreddit kind of solved a lot of problems. No big deal that there was no activity, didn't have to give up the crown, the baton, and could also partake in the protests, which they wanted to be part of. But then something happened. On July 19th, the subreddit opened back up again. And I wouldn't be surprised to hear later on that it was opened back up under duress. That is Reddit admins mailing the existing mod team and saying, reopen the subreddit or else. Now, was this a situation where someone complained to Reddit? Community members, maybe even Daybreak Games, I think it hurt them a lot not having the subreddit. Or was it just a case where the Reddit admins were working down the list? They had made it through the tens of millions, through the millions, through the hundred thousands, and they were finally chunking through these closed subreddits that were under that threshold and it just was Planetside 2's time. But, whatever the reason was, on July 19th, the subreddit reopened about a month and a half after closure with a few unique rules. The sidebar rules only stated that all posts must be in service of making Reddit more money. So definitely a very sarcastic anti-Reddit rule. And the mod stated that the subreddit was now PVP enabled. And what that meant is Automod would act on every report and instantly delete any post or comment that was reported. No review necessary. Remember that post from Smedley eight years ago that you didn't like? Report it and it got removed. Didn't like a post from a guy two minutes ago? Report it and it got removed. So for about 36 hours, the subreddit was open to complete PVP, where if you hit that report button, you could delete anything on it. While I disagreed with the premise of joining the protest, the reality is the subreddit had sort of devolved into either people being dicks to each other or just nothing happening. Posts were sitting at five to six upvotes in general. It just was pretty dead. So I'm kind of like, well, if this is the end, what the hell? This is a hilarious way to go out. Where if all of the community just sits there and reports everything that's happened over the past 10 years, to me, it would be a kind of funny way to reminisce about things. Every day you could check it and what's the new top post? Sadly, I got there a little late and I remember a Vanu guy riding two mag riders as rollerblades. That was the top post for a while. That one had been reported and deleted long before I got into the PVP zone. It would just be funny to see in three days, in seven days, in 20 days, what's left? What's the top post? Anyways, so that social experiment went on for a little bit, but then we got this. 
Dun 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 mod code of conduct arrives. He's got the fancy red snoo reddit icon. The subreddit has been locked. You can no longer post. They were not bright enough to delete the mocking rule while they did this, but they very much did come in clap cheeks and remove the existing mods. Again, I don't know, was it the PvP enabled mode that finally triggered it and they're like, whoa, why are all these posts getting deleted? We gotta intervene. Or was it a situation where they went to the mods and said, hey, you guys gotta reopen. So the mods thumb in their nose said, sure, we'll reopen, but we'll create these new weird rules. And when the Reddit admins saw that, they were obviously upset and decided to remove them. Now I was very worried at first, is this just gonna land with the first Reddit troll that pops up here? Fortunately, though, Varunda dropped in an application, the community boosted him to the top, and he was granted the new head mod position, and I couldn't be happier. I can't think of anyone better for it. The moderator leadership was transferred within six hours of the Reddit admins taking over the server, so it wasn't a very drawn-out process. Sounds like they did put a lot of the back-end work back to default, so the new mods will have their Hands full setting it all up again. We will have to be patient for that. It's funny, I need a we interrupt the story to bring you breaking news graphic. As I am making this video, the subreddit is changing and updating. It looks like the PvP events have been reverted. The old top posts are there again. And a lot of posts that I think were never really intended to see the light of day are now there as the most recent ones. Now, during the downtime, community manager Mithril really stepped up his game on the Planet Side 2 official forums. He was always active in them, but he made sure to really stay on top of it when that was the only avenue for kind of forum communication. It makes sense to me that the official forums kind of stay the main line of communication going forward, just because the subreddit being controlled by a private party, you never know what could happen when it could go offline. I think it's going to have to stay on the community's shoulders to repost things to the subreddit that are relevant, patch notes or other details. But the bottom line is, love it or hate it, the subreddit is back now. A few details are still being worked out, but you can go there and post normally and it will show up normally at this point. So let me hear from you about it. Are you boycotting Reddit? just for the whole drama over the third-party apps and their access to the API. What's your thoughts on the Planet Side 2 subreddit? Was it a valuable tool? Is it really important that we have it back? Was it a meh thing? Couldn't care either way whether it's there or not? Or was it a cesspool that you actively avoided? For me, I did still actively track it, but more for the sake of the old times, when I really saw it as a good discussion and valuable tool for the community to interact around the game. It definitely felt like it lost some of that over the years, but that's sort of part of a game just aging. We'll see if the new mod team can kind of take it back to its roots and kind of revitalize it as a good discussion tool around the game. Good luck to them. Update for me, if you've seen a few of my shorts lately, I am neck deep in ripping apart a house. So that is slowing me down a lot, but I certainly do have a lot to talk about especially this summer directive, the trends of where Planet Side 2 is going and what the next steps are without RHEL. So you'll be seeing more of that for me very soon in the future. When I'm not here, I miss you guys. I appreciate all of you hanging in there until the next one. But that will be it for me for now. I am Commander Sirius. And until next time, I will see you Planet Side.